Hello everyone, huge shout out to Jaw if he's watching this video and we are here today and it's quite exciting because we've got a new character and again I have to say at the same time it's hype but it's a little bit annoying because they've done it in the same way. I think this is just the way it's going to happen now where it's just prize wall, prize wall, prize wall, prize wall for the new character every single time which I guess isn't the most annoying thing in the world but it would be nice to see them sort of put some characters back in in a different way to obtain them. But we've got little John. So I I got the email last week from this. Well, I got it forwarded. And um, I looked at him and I thought he looked pretty cool. But I was hoping that he's going to be a little bit unique. Now, I haven't looked at him yet. I always like to do the sort of first reactions as I go down here. But I'm hoping that they kind of give us a bit more of a unique character instead of just following the normal that they've been going down where it's just like, oh, here's a character who's special, instantly kills everybody, and it's the same every single time. So that's it at the moment. Um, this update ref this update features just Little John. There isn't anything else in here. So let's take a look and see. So he looks cool. He looks, I mean, he looks exactly the way. I have to always say the art team do a very good job every single time in this game. They are very good. So let's have a look. He's a tank. We didn't particularly need another tank. Um... But let's take a look because it basically I like to compare the tanks to the likes of like Baymax. Is someone ever actually going to top Baymax is the question. Now I've already just clocked the first move and it's already kind of annoyed me. So Little John charges through the enemy team dealing normal damage and snaring all enemies. Now snaring's nice but to be honest with you that's just a copy and paste of most of the characters that have come out recently. Now I'm not having a go I'm just saying I mean most of you can put that together that Basically, every character that comes out recently just has a move where they just sort of walk through everybody and it does a bit of damage. Normally, it kills everybody straight away. So that's not boding well because that's an immediate kind of like, ah, right. So that's not going to be helpful. But I mean, it's probably going to be a good move. And he is a tank. So mm, I'm not too sure about that one. I'll definitely test him out and see when I do my nerf episode. But um, yeah, so not too impressed by that one. Let's see if his other skills can redeem him. So we've got robbing the the rich. Little John bows to the enemy team, decreasing all enemies' reality while increasing his own by the same percent. That's pretty cool. The increase and decrease last a few seconds. The reality decrease has a chance to fail. So that's kind of a bit like Clawhouse's one. So I'm not about to say that this is like, oh, this is next level again, but it's good. Reality on the tank makes sense. But again, not blown away by that move. So we've got Fortune's Forecast. Little John waves at the furthest enemy, distracting them and decreasing their armour for a few seconds. That's quite cool. He's just going to wave at someone. I like that he's going to distract them because distracting them is the same thing as um, not Ian. The other guy does. Ian's brother does. Where he calls all the enemies on him. So it's quite nice to see a few more characters having um, a distract move, especially as a tank. That obviously makes a lot of sense. So I think that's good. After using this skill, Little John will dodge the next projectile aimed at him. So that's pretty good again. Um, it's going to keep my life a bit longer. But again, it's nothing like... Almost what I say with these is that it, like... Phoby or Phobius or Phobus, whatever his name is. He had a lot of unique moves which I hadn't seen before. With his um, speed increases and like the way it all worked. But this character, it almost doesn't warrant a new character... Now, I'm curious to see what you guys think, so do comment down below and let me know your opinion on that. But um, I'm not saying I'll do all this trash, trash, but I'm just saying it, it's a cool looking character, but it just doesn't seem like it warrants a new character because he's not doing anything that like the other characters aren't doing. So I'd have liked to have seen a little bit more uniqueness there, considering these characters are kind of locked behind a paywall uh, if you don't get lucky. So, Belly Bastion. Little John's basic attack now knocks back and stuns enemies for a few seconds. Fortune Forecast now provides a Little John, uh, now provides Little John with a shield with a HP. With a shield with HP. Well, all shields have HP, so I'm not sure what, what that means. Is that some sort of different thing? Or is it just saying the shield's going to have an X amount of HP? But um, I like that his basic attack's going to knock back and stun. That's pretty good. And getting a shield is pretty good as well. But again, not sort of pushing the boat out there. Let's see if, let's see if he can be redeemed with his red skill. Little John now deals an additional... Little John now deals... 
And that doesn't make sense. Little John now deals additional fantastic damage and steals random buffs from each enemy hit with Chummy Charge. He then gives these buffs to his allies for a few seconds. So again, that's not a huge new thing, but that does make his Chummy Charge quite good because he's going to run through everybody and take everybody's buffs away. Now, the question you guys always ask me, am I going to work on him? No, I'm not going to. I'm not at all. Like, when I was reading Phobius's moves, I sort of had, I was picturing in my mind, oh, he worked well on my team A, B, or C. But this character just, yeah, not at all. Again, I mean, fair play, they're still doing updates. I'm not trying to have a go. I'm just saying I don't think this character sort of, uh, this character even warrants being a new character. It's not good enough. It doesn't seem like it's going to work. I'm not, I, I can guarantee you he's going to be one of the most overpowered characters in the game because that's just the way this game's going at the moment, which is a bit annoying. But I would have liked to have seen something a little bit better there. But there he is. There's Little John. I'm curious to see what you guys think about that because, like I said, he's not really anything special, but he's there. And yeah, I'm going to work on him. I want to see how far I can get with him. But at the moment, he does not top Phobius, in my opinion. Um, so, yeah, and we've got a few slight adjustments off some of the characters here as well, or where people are going to be and where things are being moved to. But, um, yeah, so I'm, I am, of course, still quite happy with it. It's a new update, but they haven't done any actual... I think the thing that's been annoying me um, the most recently is that they haven't actually done any, like, game changes. If you know what I mean, there's no new modes, there's no new kind of tweaks to modes to make the game more balanced. So I do feel like they are missing out on a few bits and pieces. Because yes, I understand it's important to add characters, but I think if they took a month or two to stop adding characters and sort of working on, you know, they spent a week on each game mode, sort of balancing it, scaling it up, making it sort of give you more rewards because it's almost impossible now to actually work on all the characters. So that's why I'm really hoping that they are going to put in um, a, a pause to the max levels because, you know, I said it a few times, it's almost impossible to get all these characters maxed out. And a lot of these characters I haven't worked on are very good. But, um, you know, I just pick a couple of the most overpowered ones. So I've maxed out Baymax, Lee, Bolt, you know, some of the ones that you guys have recommended, obviously. But yeah, that's kind of where I sit at the moment. And it and it does irritate me a little bit because I'd, I'd like to see it, you know, I'd like to see, because I do enjoy this game, but I feel like it's kind of just going downhill. And it's a shame to say that because I've played it for a few years now. And, you know, I, I've enjoyed making videos on it and I've enjoyed playing with you guys as well. But I'd like to see then prioritize some actually sort of um, life changes in the game, not just sort of dumping in characters all the time. But I don't know, that's my opinion. Like I said, I, if I've come across a map, I'm not really having a moan. You know, they can do what they want to say a game. But um, yeah, that's just kind of what, what I'm thinking. And I want to know what you guys think as well. Oh, that was lovely. I've maxed out all his skills now as well, which is good. I have been going through doing his missions in here just to get him ready. I'll probably do his PvP tomorrow, guys. And then I want to get a few more of his mods up. So let's let's see where we got to here as well. Claim my videos. So I I did a bit of a rinse and invasion this time. I think I got to tier 35. Tier 32, lovely. Get a few more of those ready to level them up. And we got the Guild of Contest Champions, which is going okay in the arena, obviously. And I should be on the next tier now. I think I went at one. Yeah. Because I like yeah, I I did not I got destroyed. Look at that. Four million. 10 million so again the rewards are good but i say again that isn't really enough so let's do this one here oh my goodness this is a disgusting team i'm going against did you just see the attack speed of wasabi that's ridiculous well on that very sad note i'll see what you legends in the next one do drop a comment down below. Let me know what you think of Little John. I mean, you know, I am excited. It's a new character. I'm excited to test him out, see what he's like, see if it proves me wrong what I said. But I would just like to see some fresh things coming into the game. So comment down below. Let me know what you think. And I'll see you legends in the next one.